Hey friends, welcome to our morning work today. We are going over number 158. Hopefully you've already clicked the awesome blue link. You've gone in, you've done all your answers, and then now you're back checking your answers, okay? So what two numbers go before 158? We have 156 and 157. What two numbers go after 158? 159. And 160, 160 is 158 odd or even. It ends in a zero, two, four, six, or eight, so we know it is even. 17 plus 10. Now let me teach you something. When you're looking at this problem, we see that there are numbers in our tens place and there's numbers in our ones place. So we always need to start with the ones place first. If you look in the number 17, what number is in the ones place? A seven. And then what number is in the ones place on the number 10? A zero. So let's just look at the ones. So seven plus zero. What's seven plus zero in this ones place? Seven, right? We know seven plus nothing is seven. Now let's take a look at the tens place. So in the tens place in 17, we have a one. And then in the tens place on the number 10, we have a one. So what is one plus one? Two, right? So in our tens place, we can write a two. Guess what? Because we wrote a seven in our ones place and a two in our tens place, our answer is 27. T 17 plus 10 does equal 27. So this is correct. Now, 34 plus 4. Hold 34, count up 4. So 35, 36, 37, 38. 34 plus 4 is 38. We don't really need to add on for 90 plus 8 with our strategies because we automatically know that 90 plus 8 should be 98 because of there being a 0 in that one's place plus 8 makes it easy for our brains, 98. Now again, let's try our strategy with our ones adding first and then our tens on this next one. 51 plus 40. So let's look at our ones place first. So in the ones place for 51 is a one. In the ones place for the number 40, we have a zero. So what is one plus zero for our ones place? One, right? That's easy. Now let's look at our tens place. We have a five in our tens place plus a four in our tens place. So what is five plus four? Nine. So nine in my tens place and a one in my ones place makes the number 91. Guess what? 51 plus 40 does equal 91. So that is correct. Maybe you can try that out on our next morning work tomorrow when you're doing it by yourself. All right, math sentence. 100 plus 50 plus eight equals 158. 23 is less than 79, nine is less than 75. We have 100, we have five tenths, one, two, three, four, and five, and we have eight ones, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, 52, 54, 56, 58, we're counting by twos. So next would be 60, then we have 62, 64, 66. Okay, let's take a look at our ABC order. For our ABC order today, we have the words talk, walk, hawk, lock, sock. So first, we would have the word hawk, then we would have lock, then we would have sock, then we would have talk, and last, we would have walk. Right, and three sentences about candy. Shout out your favorite candy to me right now. What's your favorite candy? I have a couple. Starburst favorite reds 
And I really like Reese's Peanut Butter Cups because I love peanut butter. I don't really like chocolate that much, but I love peanut butter to where I love Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. Do you like those? Yeah? All right. So my first sentence is going to say, I have two types of favorite candy. My first favorite is Starburst. Favorite reds. Actually, I need to capitalize all those words because it's the name of the candy. It's a proper noun. Okay, so I have two types of favorite candy. My first favorite is Starburst Favorite Reds. My second favorite are Reese's Peanut butter cups. Period. All right, so I made sure to capitalize my name, the names of my favorite candy because that is a proper noun. So make sure that you capitalized the name of your favorite candy because it is a proper noun. It's the name of your candy. All right. I also have spaces between my words, periods at the end. I have capitals at the beginning. So I'm all good there. I hope that yours looks awesome too. And turn it into your teacher all into Canvas. Click that submit assignment button. Don't forget.